Rockies Moore. And that ball is halfway up the batter's eye. The bat. Two nothing St. Louis on their 100th. Dodgers have 116. The Braves have 126. Fastball up, 95, 02. Well, that was quick. Yeah, that, and that was. Can, it just puts him in a bad spot. Lane Thomas comes charging in, and he's there in plenty of time. And Joey is going to serve one just foul. Ball hit softly. I mean, Jordan Montgomery will get his strikeouts. It's like 22 percent. And Joey lifts one right field line. Why Carlson was really playing should go on the whole thing. Here we go. And you know what? Sometimes it takes a pitcher fly ball to the gap fell in. Cost the Nats a run. And you never know. That would have been. Right. I've shared this before. And Davies expression there reminds me of something. Good take by Stone Garrett. And he's facing Montgomery. Hold up. Make it a routine. And these are growing pains of a young ball before. One and two at 95. There. Then he fights it off. I was wondering, is Brian Walsh going to give that side of the plate again? And to the right side, Paul Goldschmidt, easy for him. And the Nats, Victor playing very, very deep on Brendan Donovan, and that's off to the left side. And this all goes back to the third inning triple. And then, of course, Edmund scored right after that. Got St. Louis started on the road back from the 5 nothing depth. And then their comeback was complete in the fifth inning when he hit the three run homer again. Breaking ball. A nice one. Drops in. 2 2. All right. So this is what we were talking about yesterday with the, the whole thing with. And a breaking ball for a base hit. Right after a fastball, 95 up night last night. Victor, a short lead. Montgomery was very quick to the plate right there. CJ and a healthy hack. Andrew Kinzer behind the plate, three for 20. First base side, Goldschmidt kind of floats the throw over there. Seattle on the next road trip. Three ball games in each city. Ball to center to start the Nats game. This ball's well hit, but the wind's going to knock it down. Carlson was playing shallow. Nats who were on the field for that milestone. Top of the fourth inning, and this ball out to center. All right, the Danny Espinosa play against Pedro Alvarez in the eighth inning that ended that inning. You remember Danny kind of out, always a play in a no hitter that saves it. As for that play, Danny told me that at that point, Max was sealed, which allowed him to glove that ball and make that play. So that got Max out of the eighth inning and allowed him to then. So the last four outs were contact outs. And of course, that featured the infamous Jose Tabata at bat. That ball roasted into the left field corner by Wilson Contreras. I would have never done that, but. So Max was within one pitch. Perfect game. I don't need to tell you what the blank means, but Wilson in his head that day as well. Yeah, that was uh, the day Max was striking out everybody in New York. Mm hmm. Oh, Walker tossed his bat. No, it's not, but at the same time, he is a rookie. Out to right center first time. He's going to get called out again. He looked back at the umpire, and I think he knew he was going to get punched. And the amazing things Max did, the 20 strikeout game would follow against the Tigers. Left field on that one. The Max one and ours. Oh, my gosh, that play. By Steven Suzanne. And McKenzie will move his feet around. Like it. The thing I remember about three. 
And that's up and in now, three and one. Yeah, it was. He stayed locked in. Two out walk. That day for their double A affiliate. I was late getting out there in my pregame routine. I was about 10, 15 minutes his organization. Yeah, but the question was, was he cheering for Max Scherzer or he cheered for his team? I did not ask yeah, you that question. Asked that yeah. <laughs> Fastball up to Paul DeYoung in the counts, even 1-1. One, one. McKenzie struck him out for. That's need that to be foul, and it is by five or six feet. Ooh, nice pick. Woo. And a home run swing by DeYoung straight back and went on the 96 heater. Now we're starting. Three two runners on the move to the right and out of play. One. You got to go with your best pitch. Whatever you are most confident in right here. Impossible. Base is loaded. Kind of give him the. I'm going to give you the one here. Harrison, right? The ball cap and the visor? No, I think he had a visor, I swear. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it. That's the 27th pitch of this inning. Right in there. 95 with the heater. Kisner could not. Garcia. Front door in the breaking ball and Luis was trying not to bail there, but his feet were all over the place. And a bouncer way out in front. Kisner got a piece of it. Now he's back even. Big series at Marlins. Hammered the Blue Jays last night. They gained a half game. They won five in a row. There's only four guys. Center. Carlson playing very shallow. Oh. Time to chase him home immediately. Here's Jamer. Yeah, it'd get him in, but early on, look for a pitch to drive. Be eyes. Oh. Garcia. Almost four. This is where Joey's at his best. Runners in scoring position. 441. And the best with the runner at third, less than two for the Nats this year. He's 10 for 12. 2 0 count. And this ball's popped up. Goldschmidt. Are strikes, but they're their strikes. But are they their strikes? Are they the 2 0 strikes at the one pitch, one spot?